Happy, Happy birthday, Sean Ali. Bonina, it's Jason. Just wanted to say happy birthday, congratulations, and we had a great time celebrating with you. Hi, I'm Antoinette Sedita, and Ann Alice, I want to wish you a very happy 100th birthday. You're very loved by everyone, and I wish you all the best. I am very grateful to be here, and I would like to wish Alice a very happy 100th birthday. I enjoy being with Alice all the time, and when every New Year's when we go over to the beach house to be with her. Hey Alice, happy 100th birthday. We're so happy to be here with you and thank you for inviting us to celebrate with you. We love spending all special occasions with you. Like Star Wars had said on 4th of July, when we get to see you at the beach house and New Year's Eve at our house, we really enjoy all the nice memories we have been able to share with you and make with you. We're so uh, proud to be a part of your family and we love you so much. I'm grateful to be here with all of your family. Love you. Bye, Alice. Hi, Alice. Happy 100th birthday. I want to thank you for being so good to my family, my children, and with, together with Sergio and Priscilla. It's always been a pleasure to see you on the holidays, especially uh, out at the beach in South Hold. And we look forward to seeing you more and more. Very happy birthday. This is Kathy. I'm so glad I was able to participate in your big celebration. Um, I'm so glad that you've been such a great friend to my mom all these years and such a, an important part of our family. I consider you part of the family and I just wish you a very happy birthday. Love you lots. Enjoy your birthday. Hello Alice, it's Rose. You know the one that says that I used you as my model to teach me how to walk very, very slow and how to, how to uh, find everybody's name out. And because I don't have my memory as far as names is terrible. So every time you ask me what's her name, I go over to her and I ask her her name and that's how I find out. And thank you very much for your help. Hi, I'm Jeremiah Healy. I'm Alice's new boyfriend. <laughs> Alice and I started hanging out approximately two years ago. And the thing I like about Alice the most is that when you sit with Alice and talk, you have to bring your A game. And she keeps you, Alice, the qualities of Alice that I like is that she's a great listener. She always listens. She lets you talk. And then she gives you feedback. Maybe sometimes it's not what you want to hear, but it's what you need to know. And I just want to wish Alice, um, the best on her birthday, and I'd like to see her back here in 10 years, God willing. And Alice, happy birthday. Thank you. Hi, Alice. It's Marianne F. Unfortunately, the other half of the group couldn't be here tonight. Herb is not feeling too well. So you're going to have to put up with me. I love Alice dearly. She is such a wonderful person. And the one thing I love most about Alice is her notes. She always writes beautiful notes. And the other day, we got a note from Alice because I send Alice for Christmas always little note cards. So we sent her note cards for Christmas. And last week in the mail, we received a note card from Alice thanking us for the chocolates. She said, I am a chocoholic. And I'm so happy that you sent me chocolates. And I looked at my husband and I said, well, Alice is 100, we can forgive it. Next day, note comes in the mail from Alice. Boy, is my face red. 
I'm so happy you sent me note cards, not chocolates. Happy birthday, Alice. Keep sending those notes. We love them. Everybody now, yeah. Birthday, Alice. Um, I know uh, I hardly ever call you Alice. I usually call you Mrs. Sedita, but I decided today I'm going to call you Alice because I went through a list of the most popular baby names for 1912. Alice, you made number 11. So, okay, I'll call you Alice. But anyhow, I've known you 56 years, and I remember when I was dating Vinny and I would come home from work and walk down Kenilworth Place. Your mom would be sitting on the porch, and I'd have to wave to her, and occasionally you were home from work by then, and we, I would wave to you. So I've seen your house in Brooklyn, and then we had this great experience in 1999 going to Italy for three weeks. We went to Sicily, we went to uh, Sorrento, Rome, and then we went to Venice. But then the favorite spot for me was when we went to Florence and we saw your house that you lived in with Sergio and B and your husband Luigi. So actually I've seen two times that you've had different houses but my favorite was the one in Florence and uh, I have cherished memories of all the time uh, I've known you and I just want to say we all love you and you are the best. Thank you. Alice, this is John Cronin and his wife Kay. I'm happy to be here at your 100th birthday and I want to thank you very much for being Danny's, my youngest brother's mother-in-law. It was quite an honor. Thank you, Alice. Congratulations. I'm Diane Healy. I'm a good friend of Bee's and of the family for many, many years. Alice, I want to wish you a wonderfully, wonderful, happy birthday. You just are an inspiration to everybody with your positive attitude and the joy that you give to everyone else. I hope that the rest of your years are very good to you and look forward to sharing them with you. Best of luck and happy, happy birthday. Okay, we're Jerry and Mary Ann Cronin uh, from Rochelle Park in New Jersey. Uh, Dan uh, Cronin's brother, uh, B is our sister-in-law. We love her very much and of course we love Alice as an extended member of our family. Alice, there's nothing more that I can say except people have paid you tributes all day long. All I can do is wish you good health and many, many years. Thank you and God bless you. Demas, and I'm known as Corey, and this is my husband, Matt Rurick. 
and um, I've been so lucky because I acquired Alice by marriage because my cousin George, JG, married B, and that's how I got to knew, know Alice years ago. And um, she's been really the most wonderful member of our family, and she's been there at all of our family occasions and has watched my two children, Austin and Artemis, grow up. And my parents absolutely adored Alice, and they used to go to St. Croix with her all the time. My parents aren't alive anymore. And for me, it's very special to have Alice still with us and to have her be here and to have her, have her sort of carry on the spirit of her whole generation. So, um, Alice, happy birthday, congratulations. Um, and we, we love it that you're here with us and that you're 100. Congratulations, Alice. One, two, happy birthday to you. Cha 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 cha. Happy birthday to you. Cha 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 cha. Happy birthday to Alice. Great grandma. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday, Alice. Happy birthday, birthday. birthday. Nanita. I love you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Nanina. Happy birthday very much. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I'm Pat O'Connor. I think you know me. I've been your, your daughter B's friend for a very long time. And I have so many memories of you coming to our house for Christmas and for other holidays and seeing you for so many holidays. Happy birthday. Hi, my name is Celia Terenzio. I'm Marion Terenzio's sister. And um, Alice, happy birthday and many, many more. Um, a couple of years ago, you came to my house down in Florida, and it was actually around this time. And you told us that you were having a party in two years for your birthday, and we had to come. And I remember you sitting at the table, and your son Sergio and my dad, who you're going to see in a minute, we're talking Italian, and you were talking Italian, and all the girls, Marion, Pat, B, and a friend of mine, Mary Alice, um, whose mother's birthday is the same as yours. You're talking Italian to them, and all of a sudden they're laughing, and you turn and says, what are you girls saying over here? <laughs> What's going on over here? You don't ever miss a beat, and, um, and that's why you're still here, love and life. God bless you. Marion Terenzio. Hi, Alice. I have the honor and privilege of knowing you because of Pat and B. And I became one of the girls, but now I know that the biggest honor was to become one of the girls because of your their relationship to you. So I'm very honored to be one of the I'm one of Alice's girls, but a, a couple years younger than your other girlfriends. I understand, but it's still an honor and happy birthday. Here's my dad. Hi, hey Alice. <clears throat> this is Manny Terenzio. I hope you enjoy my uh, birthday card. And I'll tell you one thing, if you stop counting, I'll catch up to you. Kathy Babinski, I'm the club leader of the Melville unit. I remember uh, I was planning a trip to Italy and I knew Alice had spent some time in Italy so her and I had a bunch of conversations about Italy and she got me so excited for my trip. It was 
amazing and unbelievable and what I remember most is that she remembered every single detail about her days there and she remembered the way she felt while she was there and she remembered the flowers that grew and the smells that she loved the most and she remembered the way the weather was and the way even like she would describe like her entrance way to her house and how appreciative she was that she was able to spend all her time there and uh, I myself feel lucky to know Alice and feel lucky to have had spent time with her and have conversations with her and I feel it's part of oral history. She's taught me a lot. Happy birthday Alice. Happy birthday Alice. This is Pete Dufault. The only thing I really remember about you or, is your mind. It, no matter when I speak with you you're always talking about the present. You never talk about the history, you're always on up to current events, and I really admire that in you. God bless you and hope you have many more. Hi, I'm Ellen Lyons. I'm Bee's friend for about 40 years, and Alice, I want to say happy birthday to you. And I remember many years ago when my daughter Nina was about four or five, and you and your husband, who was still alive then, babysat so B and I could go out to dinner and Nina was thrilled and I always remember that. It's been wonderful to have you and B in my life. Happy birthday Alice. Hi Alice, Joan and Tom. Done. Um, we're so happy to be here for this very special day of yours. We wish you happy birthday and many more happy years. Um, you're just exactly what I would love to be if I ever grow up. Thank you. Hi Alice, it's Mary. I did say your speech. You're a beautiful person and I'm having a great time. Hope to see you soon and lots of love for myself and the unit. Okay, I want to thank your, your son. He's a real gentleman and I want to thank you for the beautiful party that you're having. And I'll see you soon, honey. Take care. We all love you. you a happy 100 year birthday. It's an incredible accomplishment for an incredible woman. We've loved having you as our neighbor and friend and we're always there for you when you need us so don't forget that and thanks for inviting us to such an incredible event. It's a great party. You could feel the love in the room and just want to wish you the happiest birthday. You deserve everything. Happy birthday, Alice. Happy birthday, Alice. You're an incredible inspiration every single day and you just embrace life and and that I just always think of you um, the way you are and just keep on keeping on and happy 100th birthday. You're amazing. Love you. Alice, a hundred years. Wow. Uh, we all hope that we make it to that age, but it's not just getting to 100, it's getting to it the way you've done it. So extraordinary. And I have a note at home on my kitchen counter that you wrote after our Christmas gathering just a few weeks ago in your fine, steady hand, remembering all the details and so graciously done like everything that you do. I know if my mother and father were here, they would be wishing you well. And wherever they are, that's what they're doing. Happy birthday, Alice. Happy birthday. Hi, Alice. This is Chris. And this is Art. And we want to congratulate you for your 90th year and your 100th year and maybe your 110th year, okay? We think that uh, we've enjoyed your company on many of our trips and we thought that you were one of the nicest 
and most authentic people we've ever known. We really enjoy your company and we hope that you, we see you here in another 10 years. Put your hands above your heads, everybody. So clap it now. Come on, everybody. Clap your hands. Come on. Hi, Alice. This is Vinnie DiGiacomo. You know me. You know me for almost 60 years. Sergio was best man at my wedding, and I was best man at his wedding. And we go back a long time. I remembered years ago when you were first learning how to drive. You were probably only 41 years old, and I was a teenager, and I took you in the car up Rogers Avenue. What fun that was for a teenager. And it was just great knowing you all these years. We've been friends for almost 59 years and I wish you a very, very happy birthday and many more years to come. Ciao. Hi, Alice, this is Madeline. Thank you so much for including me in this party. It was beautiful. I wish you many more. I am the daughter of uh, Alice's best friend who was seated with her at the dais today, my mother, Rosemarie McCloy. And Alice has joined us for so many family functions, so many wonderful dinners, so many occasions when we've had fantastic family celebrations. And Alice is truly a member of our family. We think of her that way. We love her dearly. dearly. And Alice, I want to wish you the happiest birthday and congratulations on making it to 100. <laughs> Keep going strong, Alice. We want you around for a very long time. We love you. And my heart is with you today. Hi Alice, it's Phyllis Brown. Harry and I had a wonderful time and 10 years ago you, kept, you said to Harry, I'm going to live to my 100th birthday and have a big party. You accomplished that deed with tickle that you did. We love you and we will still see you at our meetings at the Melville Unit. And thank you for a wonderful time and being a wonderful friend. Bye now. I'm George Demas. Um, Alice is my former mother-in-law. This is my wife Kathleen. And we are just thrilled to be here for Alice again. We were here 10 years ago when she turned 90 and 
we're here today for 100 then maybe we'll be back in 10 years for 110. It's a grand party and Alice we wish you absolutely the best. You've been a great friend to us all and a great family matriarch and you always will be because we love you all. Hi Alice, it's Kathy. Um, I want to thank you for being so kind to me and welcoming and I really appreciate it and I think you're a wonderful person and happy birthday Alice and thanks again. I love Alice. I've been going to her 90th birthday and she said I want to stay until I'm a hundred and she did it and now I think she'll reach 105. God bless her. She's a lovely, lovely person. Hi, Alice. This is Lewis and Carmen Justo, and uh, we certainly have uh, known you since uh, 1966, and we've loved you every every year since we met you. So uh, we're so happy that um, you're 100 years old, and we want to be here for your 110th party. Alice, you know that we feel very special because we feel like we're part of your family after all these years and um, being part of your daughter's wonderful family and watching the kids grow up. Um, uh, and I know you feel that way about us too and, and our daughter Nicole. So um, we wish you the very best and it's been just fabulous. So uh, you're an inspiration to all of us and happy happy birthday and and uh, just one last word uh, as far as joy is concerned joy perillo Carmen, carmen's mother your good friend um i'm sure she's in heaven and she misses you um as much as um, you probably miss her bye bye
I love. 